all right welcome welcome to another fantastic stream man <laughs> honestly i am out of cards here like i have no idea what i'm gonna draw today but because i recently watched by a youtuber like peko mama and we are like like her <laughs> We're gonna draw her today, and maybe I find some good uh, artwork I can draw, and maybe learn something from it. Again, I really like, I like our use artwork. So maybe let's let's try this out, and then try also like the color palette, and try getting those fit together. Maybe, maybe I don't know. Maybe not. Oh, that's really cute really cute really cute this is a very cute drawing of her i think i've i think she deserves all the love man. but i maybe should also kind of do like some description where i got the artwork but the yeah, artwork you won't Currently you can't see anything right now, it's just like a blank canvas, but don't you worry, the blank canvas gonna disappear and we're drawing Peko, uh, Peko Mama, let's go, Peko Mama, drawing Peko Mama, let's go, or like from, from, ah, uh, how do you how do you write this new new uh, art, art let's go peko mama we we are here to go we are here to draw her let's go and i don't know if you know her or not it's <laughs> I mean, if you have take you just have to look look it up, and it's kind of very, very wholesome, very wholesome mama would say. It's, it's also very interesting to see like VTubers and their their mom. Exactly, Peko Mama from all the life. Let's go, baby. Who is with me? <laughs> it's with me. Uh, okay, VTuber. What was different? Let's see. Man. Pinterest uh, and eh, I mean she's not really anime characters, features. Peko Mama. Peko Mama. Maybe I'll find um a like uh her character sheet that would be kinda nice. Peko Mama character sheet. Uh Peko Mama character character sheet maybe ah there we have it there you have it okay let's go wow it was 2016 damn this is that's pretty old man uh let me see yeah got it uh let me open that uh also kind of maybe Combine those uh, things that I saw. It doesn't make any sense what I'm saying right now, uh, but <laughs> keep listening to my story. All right, all right. Uh, maybe I will do a, another different pose, maybe, uh, and get like maybe the style of this artist, and then I'm doing like a maybe different pose like I did with Iron Mouse. Uh, let me see, course practice but the rest it is uh yeah and there to save that thank you very much this is where we can delete that so now i can finally open up and show you the goods very cool and good <laughs> I have two things to draw today. I would like this from Yuri. And then I guess this is just like when we're doing like the 
a different pose. Maybe we get like a different pose and then I put it on there. Maybe again like a little bit that style inspired. Let's see how it goes. And yeah, I think that's and that's the that's the stream session for today, I would say. You like that, Fix. Maybe you like it, maybe you don't like it. Tried my best, but didn't succeed. <laughs> so there we have it. I'm doing one step at a time. Let me just put like the artist there so I don't steal from other people's. I mean I guess there's also like a saying a copy just steals from one artist, a great artist steals from everybody. Artist or oh, for and I guess at the at the end of the day it's like kind of mishmash of everything you you learn. You learned on the way, you know. Uh, and I think it's really important to kind of get inspired by other people's work, getting it done, getting. Also, like the line work is also kind of very nice to see. I kind of like that one. It's very, very nice. But anyway, I guess it's very standard pose. I guess. Where like the Horizon is like in the middle, I think. And with that out of the way, man, she cute exactly, and that's why we're drawing her. We're drawing her, getting like a good, uh, again practice, and then drawing her in a different pose. And let's see how far I will go today. So. Hope you like the show. Hope you buckle up and yeah, let me tr let me try and draw her. Always and I always start with like uh, like the horizon line, and, and we can move on. Let's go. They kind of like this, right? She kind of looking down to the side. She kind of, she kind of nice. She also very. <laughs> she, it's kind of funny how like VTubers, VTubers moms, kind of taking over sometimes the VTuber stream. It's kind of honestly, it's very very wholesome. I think in my opinion, <laughs> very wholesome. I really like that. I really like that. It's like uh, daughter and son, daughter, daughter and mother connections, doing like, I don't know what you call like, maybe family binding, <laughs> something like to get, to get better, to get better with each other, uh, but yeah, it's take some time to realize that I don't know why <laughs> my, my game is a little bit off today but maybe if I keep a little bit going maybe it comes back but anyways how are you guys doing <laughs> I haven't really asked you guys everything alright everything is good nobody got like an injury or something like that everybody is kind of safe safe and sound nobody fought like a beer because bears kind of like kind of scary if you really think about it if i were to fight a beer i think i wouldn't stand a chance against a beer but maybe like a baby be baby beer if it really it depends on it like going full ham and just ignore my pain and then bam let's go Garrett hitting with the right hook, left hook, left, right, and good night. I guess you have to be also very strong. I mean, in the end of the day, you're kind of going like you're trying to survive. I guess if you're kind of to survive, you're kind of like your instinct, your 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 brain kicks in and says, "All right, okay, there's no time to joke around. It's time. It's either I will I will kill this bear." Or I will die. 
And I think in this situation, uh, we we kind of develop like really very very strong, very strong like hidden powers. It's like I don't know we have like really hidden powers sometimes. <laughs> you really think about it because there are some cases where like if like a newborn child is like in a car or like is is kind of stuck under a car like the mother or like the father is able to put so much uh power be so, <laughs> so much power behind her and then bam she's able to uh, uh no, bring the car out like not bring a car it's like able to lift the car which is insane man like bro <laughs> are you guys able to lift a car <laughs> that 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 is insane man. like uh, like, I mean, I guess this is a good, good, a good training, but nonetheless, is able to able to lift the car, or is it's not it's not uh, like an easy feat to do. I think, and I think this is really looks very strange here. So let's make it like here. I think kind of. Not so sure. Legs are kind of kind of long, maybe a little bit too long for my taste. For my taste, my long leg. And I have nothing against long legs, but sometimes I have to keep proportion also in mind. That's not what a normal proportion looks like. I'm sorry, but I didn't make the rules like the. The people that are kind of like doing the art thing, like establish what what like a, what a optimal pose or what an optimal body proportion looks like, and I was not invited to that. But nobody, kind of like just happens. Just have to kind of like get with the times, man. Get with the times, and eventually. You accept it. I mean, some some conventions are very, very, very strange. Like how people kind of like count in French is also very weird. Like, hey, but the child, what's up? Yeah, we make uh, today. We make Peko Mama. Let's go. I found her very cute, and I thought, why not draw her today? Let's go. Let's go. And the artwork is from Aya artwork. I have a very, very cool artwork from him. So yeah. Let's go there. Also I'm kinda like uh I was I was like pivoting between like doing like a cosplay. Like doing either like drawing a cosplay or doing like another uh no. VTuber, unless I don't want to be not a VTuber, that I saw. But yeah, like, fresh card is almost... Uh, uh, yeah, I mean, that's, that's... that's I think that's a leak on its own, I would say. <laughs> like, that, that's... that's Honestly, that's a borderline criminal what they're doing there with that one. Like, who, who came up with that? And because it's like, tradition, everybody, like, kind of taught... Damn, okay, it's maybe too long. <laughs> Yeah, I'm making a little bit too long. <laughs> my bad, my bad, my bad. Uh, my bad. But yeah, because everybody like taught somebody like that. Now everybody has to kind of learn like this. I wonder if they just just stop doing it and using something different. It's like kind of like we're. The yeah, tradition kind of like fails, <laughs> in my opinion, because everybody is doing that, so everybody has to learn it like that, and that's honestly bull, bull crap, bull crappery. I think that not nice, but it's also, but on the other hand, other other hand, 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 other hand, other words. <laughs> it has its own charm, I think. Has his own charm. Like, 
how they how they count. But yeah, but I think will I ever learn French? Probably not, because no matter how good apparently, I'm not sure if this is actually true. Apparently, it's like no matter how good your fr fr French is, if you're not born in French, then and then it doesn't even matter how good your fr French is, they make fun of you or something like that. But I, I don't think so. But that's what I, I see on TikTok. Maybe I'm like a little bit crazy with that, but yeah. <laughs> really, really. I mean, yeah, I know. Maybe one day I will learn French, but probably not. I have other, other, uh, uh, other languages I'm, lear I'm currently learning, so there's that. Like, the first thing I'm currently learning is like Mongolian, so Mongolian. I haven't learned, I haven't done any vocabulary today, which is like a shame maybe. <laughs> maybe it is a shame, but it is what it is. Maybe tomorrow is a better day and I'll be able to do this. They're like... Really? They are the worst country in Europe? Why, why though? <laughs> what happened? I mean, at least, uh, I mean, at least, it's not the most unfriendly. Uh, hey, let's go, Italians and Italy. I forgot why I <laughs> say, bro. I mean, not, not the same, but I had like uh, four years of Spanish, and the most, and the, the only thing I, I got now is like, um, me amo, me amo Andy. It's like uh, uh, my name is uh, uh, my, I, I'm like Andy. Like four years of Spanish. Let's go, baby. Clever. <laughs> this is kind of sad, man. This is kind of that's really sad. That's really sad. But hey, maybe one day I will relearn all the Spanish. Probably not, but yeah, because my bucket list is like learning like Mongolian. Then after I learned Mongolian, Japanese, Korean, and Chinese, like those those languages. But that's also it. What's also very very strange is, is like when you think about languages, I think like languages in like in, in Africa, for example, are not really mentioned, which is honestly a shame. <laughs> I mean, there are, there are, there's also people down there, you know. <laughs> But it's kind of like, or maybe it's just me. Maybe I have like uh, this perception, but I think a lot of people just I don't know, like don't don't see those those people on those languages. I have not seen people who say, "Oh, I want to learn this language." Most of most of the time, it's like more European languages or like uh, Asian languages. Which is honestly maybe maybe. Not tragic, but it's kind of sad. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Who knows? It's just me feeling that, that, like that. Because I think nobody is gonna say, "Hey, I'm gonna learn English." Because I mean, everybody gonna learn Eng English at, in, at some point. I mean, English is like the world, like like the world language. Basically, I think everybody kind of understands English, and if not, then. At least they uh, speak, they can understand you a little bit. I mean, it's maybe different because maybe I heard a lot of in Japan that if you don't speak Jap Japanese, then you kind of like kind of lost. But I don't know if that's true anymore, like with the current like immig immigration, <laughs> like uh, foreign tourists com coming there and trying out things and stuff like that. Um, I would say maybe that changed for sure. Let me see how how, how did he do like? Yeah, I mean, uh, like before, I think it was like really. It was not that that great. I think it was not on that in that that great to great. To. Uh, but I think now now this I think it's better. 
like if now with the streamers and other stuff like <laughs> i mean because there's also like the situation with streamers and in japan what i also kind of um got notice of is like some people just straight say you're not about to stream or do live live stream because of the situation what happened there <laughs> I mean, because honestly, some sometimes streamers are just really like animals. <laughs> Don't you agree? <laughs> they will do anything what they want, you know. Uh, really? Okay, okay. I mean, yeah. I mean, don't, don't. I would say never do do stuff like that. Like, don't disrespect the culture. Don't. Like, bro, why are you doing this? It's like one of... It's always those things that, like, one bad apple kind of ruined it for every, everybody. And now everybody is like, oh my god, thanks, thanks, man. Thanks for nothing. But yeah, okay, this is kind of like there. Should be more, more, more bigger, I think. But yeah. Hey, fire, what's up? I mean, yeah, I'm, I'm try, trying to draw her today. I'm trying to draw her today and see how it goes. All right, and how does he do like the, the eyes? It's more like bam, bam. And also like kind of like a little bit, it's not that big. Cause, and then we have like kind of like those here and bam. All right, all right. I think that's, that's the eye shape kind of. I'm going there. <laughs> Great. What's that again? Oh, <laughs> you're doing great. Job. I mean, yeah. Hey, thanks, man. <laughs> I, I am, I'm good, man. Like, I had, I think, like, like last week, I had like some, some uh problem, like, like something happened, and, and I'm, I mean, now I'm kind of better now, which is nice. I'm bad now, guys. Let's go. And I don't know if they kind of like this is very big. I don't know. But let me see. Like kind of like her eyes are very. I can't really. I can't not really understand the eye. <laughs> let me be honest. It's more like it's maybe like a like a square kind of, or maybe like kind of like this. And then they're kind of like this, and like here, and then it's like a square. Then like maybe it's going like kind of like down there. I think that's the that's the that's the eye. Yeah, let's go, man. All right, okay, we got like this down. Now it's let's try it uh, without trying to trace it. But uh, I mean, the reason why I'm uh, um like writing a point in the chat is sometimes if somebody writes a long sentence like you can see like the heart at the this those emojis right like sometimes those emojis just like uh are behind the text or, like not that the text is behind the emoji and i can't really see so i have to push it a little bit higher so i can see what somebody is saying <laughs> Or is writing in the chat, so I don't just I don't just talk anything at all. Or like don't recognize part of people. Or like just talk and not really understand what they're talking about because that happens often to me. Just I'm just going with the flow, and then in the end of the day, what the heck is the chat talking about? <laughs> and sometimes I'm more like. Uh, uh, do I do I want to know what the chat is talking about? I'm like maybe not. But then again, I have to be like the the dude that kind of like um, I have to make a clear choice to make it PG friendly because there's my sometimes there are weird people in the chat. Not gonna lie, man. Not gonna lie. Not you guys, but sometimes you know. <laughs> Sometimes I also get one of those bad apples, man. Sometimes I get also one of those bad apples. And that's alright, man. That's okay. 
It's like I also learned like a very diff good, good lesson for like how to deal with different type of chatters and how to, what to do, what not to do. Honestly, I also am very, very grateful for that. And another thing is like, because I'm streaming right now every day, I think I'm kind of getting good at talking, talking, talking a lot, and getting the hang how how I should say stuff. But I guess my next improvement, I mean, I'm able to talk now for like one or two or three hours straight without any breaks or like more consistency than saying nothing else, nothing else. But now my other goal is like clarity. Because I think most time maybe I'm yapping so much that you guys don't really understand what I'm even talking about, you know? <laughs> and that's I think another good thing to do. <laughs> I think I have to improve on that one. I need to improve on clarity. But yeah. Hey, okay, nice. Uh, have fun on your culture festival. Ho hopefully you get, I don't know, the, the prize money. <laughs> Like in normally like in animes, <laughs> they have like some have festivals. Um, I was like, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Of course, it's just like oh, it's just practice, practice, practice. I mean, I also practice in my voice, practice my voice, and um, yeah, I was not forcing too much to say because sometimes. Emptiness is also pretty good, man. <laughs> Emptiness, like, it's not saying anything at all, and just to have like a breather is also pretty good. So, okay, um, there should be more to the slide here. I'm giving also a lot of people to write in the chat. That's also something I realize. Uh, um, um, sometimes being happy is true. Sometimes being not being the yap is the play, you know. Uh, I mean, I guess yeah. Uh, but <laughs> I have I have to learn a lot, man. I have to learn a lot. Like I have to learn a lot. And I think I'm learning a lot. The funny thing is, like, I am... Um, I'm getting the hang of it, but I was not always like this in this case. Keep on being a yeah. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, but it's sometimes not that easy. Because what I also want to learn is... Okay, I guess I think I should... Uh, practice different type of yapping like the first yapping is just like being able to talk like through like one hour two hour three hours i think that's like the duration of yapping <laughs> like having like a uh, able have having like a stamina to talk so much and so so much time and also like having like a silent 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 break, <laughs> a silent uh, hour, or like silent minute, or si silent one minute, two minutes. So it's not that uncomfortable for people because I think silent is for the people very uncomfortable. And honestly, I, I understand it. I'm, I'm I'm trying my best to be good at it. But uh, the, the next thing it would be like uh, clarity. I think that's my next step. My next step is being a, a, like able to understand what I'm yapping. I think that's the next big step I'm going to do. And I think my final step would be like storytelling. Because everybody likes a good story guys, right? So that's why I'm also starting to read a lot of short stories. A lot of a lot of short stories. Okay, there should be more like more to the side here. A lot of short stories, but sometimes those short stories that I have been reading are uh, kind of very, I don't know, very, very, very weird. Like, it's something so 
I don't know, fundamental? How, how can I explain it? Like, like somebody stole something and then uh, the, the like one story is uh, like the feeling I get from listening to stories is always like, oh, you do you somebody uh, somebody uh, does something bad, then somebody goes and said that was bad, then he apologizes and everybody's friends. <laughs> that's 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 like the short stories I'm I'm reading on like. I don't know man, maybe, maybe, <laughs> maybe that's not what's going on, I don't know, like, you shouldn't do that, it's like, I don't, do you guys know, like, Darwin, like, the YouTuber, I mean, yeah, kind of, <laughs> it's like those, those, damn man, you shouldn't uh, steal things, you should always learn, you should never cheat, this, like, kind of, like fundamental morals, but honestly, I think even having those fundamental morals, it's good to have, honestly, <laughs> because it's kind of crazy how many people don't have those those morals. Sometimes I'm like, wow, okay, wow. Just like learning from like a kids show, honestly, can make a really big difference. Honestly, there should be there should be much more. Huh? Like, let me see. Let me see. Let me see, like the theme is always like, either like, you did something bad and you now apologize, or like, uh, like, he's like, <laughs> he's like, there, 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 there was once a brave, I don't know, brave bird, he saw someone, somebody in, in need of help, the brave uh, bird, goes to him and help him. Everybody in the forest knew he was a brave bird. <laughs> Something like that. Man. Like, <laughs> what is what? What's going on, man? What is going on? <laughs> the brave bird is brave, I guess. <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this, man. So yeah, it's something like that. It's like, maybe I find some different short, short stories. Maybe I'm just like that bad at finding good sh short stories. Um, but yeah. <laughs> I mean, if you guys listen to any short stories or like have any recommendations, I'm always open for it. So like, or like kind of fairy tales, if you like that. Don't like that. I mean, audiobooks is also great. I mean, I never have, I never tried audiobooks, so I can't really tell. But I think it would be, would be kind of nice. It's more like this, like there, and then, and then, and then, and then kind of like here, I think. There, like I might make like a sketch there, here, here. And this should be a little bit more small though. There, then there. And down there. I listen to a lot of short, short stories, baby. Short stories is the thing. Because the reason why I'm trying to learn short stories is just like storytelling in general. Like, when I'm doing YouTube videos, I should be able as also to tell like, the story. Because that's honestly really, I think, the entertaining part of the video. I mean, besides of the value that you give from the video, right? It doesn't have to always be like... It doesn't have to be always be like value, right? The, can be entertaining and also like let's do do st stuff, you know. <laughs> so I'm learning that it's, it's like instead of like focusing like a learning like a, a like a big story, I think it's better to do like short short stories and getting it and getting those things done. I think it's like it's like like an art also like. 
you don't go like first to like um let's say if you can't really draw a box in in perspective right like <laughs> don't then then don't start uh, trying to uh, try to draw like a like i'm a, a spaceship i don't know or like a very a different pose uh, like in perspective you can't really can't really draw a box you know <laughs> <laughs> so that's that's my two cents on that I would say so I would say stream on us I, I, I have I forgot about it uh I have but really I forgot about it lol a lol links day baby <laughs> lol links day I'm sorry <laughs> Lol XD, I'm sorry, I forgot about the... Uh, about the... Uh, hello, Spider. Well, yeah, thank you. Okay, right, sometimes... Well, sometimes I don't think at all. Sometimes I need somebody to see what's going on, so I have my thoughts in check, you know? <laughs> That's why I have Karame, you know. Everybody needs a Karame in your life, you know, to get your, to get your things straight, and get your things done. But yeah. But but by the way, Karame, have you any uh, like, uh, do you read any books, <laughs> Karame? <laughs> do you read any books? Because I normally don't read any books, like. Besides of the books I have to read, like in school or like college, I don't really go out of my way and read books. Which honestly, it's maybe a, it's a shame. Some maybe, but I try to change that by, you know, learning how to <laughs> to do like sh sh short stories. So yeah, because I want to learn a little bit about short stories, or, like getting a little better at short stories. So yeah, if you have any rec good good short stories for me, like hit me up, man. Hit hit me up, man. Okay, let's go like there. Booba, booba. Because I think everybody should at least listen a little bit. Oh, not listen, read a little bit. It makes you more intellectual. I think it makes you a little bit more. I mean, I wouldn't say smarter, but I think your your brain would be very satisfied with 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 that. Like damn, and thank you for reading. I think because what I get always like I get the satisfaction when I'm reading <laughs> because I've read so for so long like a really good book that it's kind of like itching in my brain sometimes. I know I don't know if that's good or bad. <laughs> Probably bad. Uh, but yeah. So again, if anybody has like good short stories, good short stories recommendation, hit me up, man. Hit, hit me up one more time, baby. You know, <laughs> hit me up one more time. But anyway. Oh, okay. But there's also like, I don't know, I, there are like stories that are like only a couple sentences, like, but I don't know what, what, how, or like, what's, how, what do you call them? Like, there's just like, it's just like a sentence. The rocket by is pretty okay. All right. Okay. Then maybe I will check it out. I'm getting a little bit of that. Knowledge, I would say. Where <laughs> uh, Oh, maybe, maybe. Let me see. Like, I mean, I guess. Uh. uh maybe premise story, maybe. Like there's some like stories that are like in just a sentence, like, like it's like 
if the it is like it's just like the story is just couple said is there's a specific word for it but i i've forgotten about it or maybe it's not the really video story but like the beginning of a story kind of like the beginning of a story like the beginning of the story and it kind of hooks you into it kind of And it hooks you in. Go on there. But I have no idea what it's called again. Maybe ah uh, maybe okay okay I, I think I know I, I think I can know where, where, where it is. I have to I have to check I have to check a file, a private file. <laughs> Not really a private file, but more like I have done like uh, somewhere on my computer there's like a file where I just did a lot of YouTube stuff and maybe it's like one of those those things there somewhere maybe hopefully <laughs> because it's really really important it's like it teaches you how to kind of get like good uh, how to grab your viewers attention you know how to be wow okay what's gonna happen next kind of thing uh, but that's okay that, that, that's okay maybe I'll find it out uh, so really <laughs> it's your Pinterest full of study material <laughs> only study material I mean it's kind of good right only study material let's go baby that's what I like to see <laughs> It's, I guess it's kind of good, but also kind of bad because there's so much, I would say. There's so much to learn, so much to do. And you kind of get kind of overwhelmed, I would say. I mean, yeah, if you only use that for that purpose, like, there's yeah, gonna be like, Pedro's be like, oh wow, can we like this? Alright, let's. How about this one and this one and this one? And then, uh, <laughs> Like, you don't want to see my Pinterest because I kind of, like, at the beginning I used Pinterest for the cosplays and stuff like that. Now, you can imagine what my Pinterest is going to look like, you know? <laughs> I would say it's not safe for work for sure, but not safe for work. Uh, <laughs> ugly man. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, sometimes I think you ha have to kind of clean up your Pinterest, like, or like doing like a restart and getting, getting that done. But honestly, uh, Pinterest is really a weird side, I think, like, I don't know if you really want to, I mean, people kind of grow also on this side. It is, Pinterest is kind of like, I think a semi social media, but also not really. Because you kind of, I mean, you kind of, you kind of can upload your art, and people can follow you and stuff like that, and getting like a following. But it's kind of not the same. Like it's, it's kind of weird. It's kind of, it's kind of weird, to be honest. Like it's just maybe just me. This is maybe just me. It's kind of funny. You can get a, like a following on Pinterest and see, be like, I got one million followers on Pinterest. You know. I mean, yeah. I mean, it it's good, but also kind of bad because there's also people like they are generally want to grow on Pinterest, and then there are some people just steal their art and put it on their own thing. And that's kind of sad, honestly. But hey, what can you do, man? Don't hate, don't hate the players, don't hate the game, man. Like, there's not really like people that kind of look up and look. Okay, that's actually from him. That's that's not from him, and just try to control all, all those things, I would say. You have to be kind of careful if you kind of share your art on Pinterest, I would say. I mean, that's why I'm also going for like Twitter or X. So I, I kind of know who this artist is. And, and yeah. How long have you been drawing on your Yeah, 467 days, baby. Here we go again. Still, still going strong, I would say. <laughs> still going strong. 
still going strong. Let's go, baby. That's what I like to see, right? But yeah, I mean, one, one day, I, maybe I will add, quit. Maybe I will just stop, or like I don't know. Maybe something happened to me, and I'm unable to stream. Like that can for sure happen. Maybe I go on a holiday and just hey guys, this is the last stream for this month, and then I'm gone. Like I'm, I'm, and I'm gone. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I mean, I'll, I'll, even if I'm good enough, I think... I, I don't know, man. I think, like, I can still find a little bit of time just to draw for you guys, right? I mean, even if I find, like, a job... I mean, it would be kind of cool if I can also kind of teach a little bit. Like, doing some teaching stuff. Let's just say. Do a little bit of a teaching here, teaching there. Alright. Okay. Uh, damn, man. It's... Damn, okay. This is kind of kind of weird. The boobs are kind of weird. <laughs> boobs are kind of weird. Uh, but yeah. I mean, it's, it's also kind of sad if I kind of break the record. Or like stop doing it because i'm consistently doing this right now right like for so many days and just like just to quit even if my even on my hardest day i didn't quit which in hindsight is actually crazy that i actually did that but i think i guess i just wanted to just find a way just to forget things and just start streaming not really talk just draw a little bit uh, but yeah. Even my darkest, darkest hour, darkest night. <laughs> I still, I'm still there, baby. Alright, okay, let's go here. Uh, let's go there. Alright, yeah, kinda, kinda like there, and then... Okay, there should be like a little bit outside that. So, yeah, like I don't know. I don't know if I ever got to quit or not. Um, probably. A healthy kind of addiction. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know if it's a healthy kind of addiction, but to be honest, man. <laughs> I mean, I guess, and um, drawing and stuff like that, I, I guess. Let's go, like, maybe, like, the shape a little bit here. I'm drawing so many hours, days. Okay, there. Kind of like goes kind of like this. Let's make, like, kind of like the shape, kind of. Let's go here. I was a little bit more bigger. Uh, it's it's not really. I think it's. I guess it's like a like not an addiction. I would say, but more like a uh like a habit at this point. I have like a habit to drive every day, but I'm also kind of like going to to have like a fixed schedule too. Like, sometimes I feel like I sh could have drawn more, and if I'm gonna do this as my livelihood, I think I should push myself a little bit more than I normally do. Because I think in my life, I think I never really try to push my limits, to be honest. Like, I never really go went full and 120 or 200 percent on something, you know. I'm always like kind of, uh, what was I saying? Uh, kind of like take my time maybe here maybe there not really really fully committed I mean yeah I'm saying that like doing like 467 days straight but honestly like I don't really think like I feel like I did like something like 200% you know like, I never really thought, felt like doing that I don't know 
I have you guys ever committed like for like 200% like damn that's gonna do it I'm going to do it no matter what like have you ever have you ever guys done that because also I had like also very uh difficult I would say I had a very difficult um view of, of like hard work to be honest because the thing is like every time I worked really hard or at least think that I worked really hard uh, it always backfired on me and at some point I just gave up <laughs> at some points I thought to myself man honestly why do I even bother working so much hard if I at the end of the day I'm, I'm like failing and which was worse is like even if I like I didn't do anything and when I did do anything at all like everything became better and i'm like okay thanks <laughs> yeah but, uh, uh. but you follow uh, so they were they're not pushing boundaries and so it works just not pushing boundaries and experience what do you mean not pushing boundaries and experiments i mean i think like i like i think i i could do more but at the same times like i have a really really weird weird uh relationship i would say with myself <laughs> like i'm like i'm okay for not doing so much because like having something like that i mean it's like i guess like nice ambition like get you going get out of the bat but at the same times i think it, sh it shouldn't like consume you too so like i don't know man <laughs> i don't know man it's just just like i mean like the premise is just like i learned like i learned that like hard work doesn't pay off basically and then uh since but now, uh, but now that I've been a little bit older, grown a little bit, I realize that hard work actually pays off sometimes. <laughs> For example, when I'm doing like uh, training, like I see like the nice, uh, I see really the nice definition of my body. Like, hey, I actually become stronger and I actually become also more handsome, you know? I mean, I I mean, I guess, like, uh, I'm just following the course, honestly, and after that, I just, like, figure out what I want to do with it. Like, what I learned in the course is just, like, like, the fundamentals, but not really the applying stuff. The applying stuff is just something I have to do myself. The playing stuff is something I have to do myself. But I would say I, I for sure learn like the fundamentals for sure. It's just like I have to go the extra mile to just really implement what I learned. But yeah. Hey Kai, what's up? How how is Kai doing? How are you doing? How are you doing Kai? Hopefully you done your homework, man. <laughs> And did something for your school or something like something like that, you know? <laughs> Getting that homework done early on. Let's go, man! Like honor student, uh, honor student uh, Kai is here in the house, baby. Let's go! <laughs> Hopefully, it doesn't make you too, too uncomfortable. <laughs> It's just uh, not that someone can live in work, but, but hey. I mean, it's alright. I mean, you can do it right now if you want to, but only if you want to. And then, like, getting, like, a nice, good job from me if you want that. Like, hey, good job. I'm proud. <laughs> you know, somebody. Hey, let's go. Sometimes you need a time off with your friends. True, true, true. But also, I think it's also very important to hang out with your friends. Like, not only with your online friends, but also like real friends outside of being online, you know. 
And I think it's, it's like those those uh, little moments, I think, that really make life really worth it. Always those little things. Maybe I'm getting... Now I'm going a little bit maybe too deep. <laughs> I feel like those little, little moments, I would say, that's kind of like irreplaceable. But of course, we humans will always want more, of course, but... I think it's really important just to cherish those moments. Because you never know when, when it's time to go. That's what I also kind of learned a little bit earlier, but yeah. Hey, let's go. I mean, maybe you can work together with, with the homework, man. Maybe you can make... Maybe you can do like a study group. Maybe you like, can do like, hey guys, wanna work together? On this difficult project. Ha, how about that, huh? And then um, and then having also like fun. I think a lot of what I really miss on learning in general is just having fun too. I mean, don't get me wrong, like learning is not always fun, but it should be sometimes fun, right? <laughs> because I think like sometimes it's like kind of missing on, on starting. <laughs> Or am, I, or am I like the only one like here like I think we kind of lost a lot of starting stuff <laughs> like having fun like I mean starting is not fun but sometimes it should be fun right sometimes at least sometimes come on man give me, the, give me a little bit of just that sometimes please thank you very much <laughs> so yeah but that's just me, maybe. That's just me. That's just me. A little bit of yapping here. A little bit of complaining, even. <laughs> A little bit of complaining. So. Um. Uh. I mean, yeah. That, I mean, that, that's also kind of like difficult. I would say. <laughs> To be fair, I have never achieved that. For example, I hang on with our friends, but never really achieved like studying. Or maybe, maybe once in my life. Maybe I think I have successfully did once in my life. This was like for like a history, history like uh, exam. And funny enough, the we are I think maybe three person and two of the person are like uh, like my friend and I got like the best grades which was also kind of nice <laughs> and like because we kind of learned together which is kind of nice so that was a cool feeling to have like like our work didn't waste but yeah there's a lot of i know a lot of my life that kind of like goes like uh hard work and doesn't pay off and then you're kind of disappointed and what's the point and stuff like that really makes you kind of kind of you know de depressive i would say <laughs> uh, but I, I i'm but luckily i'm already out of it because i learned that actually hard work is is there like it will carry you it will carry you it's, uh, as i said before like doing like a lot of workout and stuff like that I've seen it on my body, like if you kind of stick to it and just work on it, your body improves and yeah, you get more handsome. So what's the moral of the story guys? Just go to the gym. <laughs> just go to the gym guys. <laughs> That's the moral of the story man. Or like long story short, go to the gym and then maybe go and uh, maybe find like a gym bro that you have. For example, today I went went to the gym. Went. I mean, I did go to the gym with a friend. That was this was a like very nice uh, nice thing to do. Like he showed me like a new new uh, new training method or like not training method, a new new exercise that I. No, I didn't know about. I mean, I I don't know. 
I, I don't know much, but I know a little bit. It was like those 21 reps where you do like some curls and then you kind of like, like the first seven kind of half push it and then the other seven like top push it and then the last seven is like uh, the full push. Like I'm like kind of standing there. And then you kind of like, let's see, like at the first time you go, you go, you go seven times like this and then you kind of like here and then you go like seven times there. Like this is, you make like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, then go there, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then you make like a seven full range, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And that's like the 21 it bro. This this goes so so much on your beat uh, biceps. This is crazy, bro. <laughs> like after like the that's like like this is like one one set, man. Now it's just like a, you have like a uh no, I would say like a like a small weight here, like curl. I don't, I don't know what you call it. And then, and then you just kind of like. Uh, push it up. <laughs> yeah, bar, bar. I mean, the, all these are short bars where you can just uh, put a little bit of a uh, oh, weight on there. But yeah, it's like doing half, and then doing the another half, and then doing the full motion and drop this step bar. This, this goes hard, man. Right? This goes hard. I mean, it's not really that. <laughs> this goes really hard, man. Right? Like. <laughs> Uh, like if you want to push your piece biceps, it's cause... like I hate it, <laughs> but it it was really good. It was really good. I mean, you can maybe try to carry me as like as I am the gym bro here, as a like a not follow follow gym bro. <laughs> maybe you like it. Maybe you don't like it. It really goes. It really goes, um, goes ham, man. It goes really ham. It goes really ham. Maybe tomorrow I will have like a muscle ache for sure. Uh, yeah. Honestly, <laughs> failure is really like that, man. <laughs> not fun. <laughs> it is really not fun, man. Uh, I'm like more like very not failure based. I mean, I for sure I don't get the most gains for that one, but <laughs> that's that's that. I know that's that. That's that. So for probably tomorrow we'll have like a really really bad, but a bad must like. But hey. For the gains, baby, for the gains, let's go. This is what I like to see, man. This is what I like to see, man. Go here. And then I have like a carrot, something like that. Like a carrot here. That's kind of cute, man. Kind of cute. Hmm? Uh. We did like do another one of with triceps extension with no rest bicep curls a different variation of this of extra it's just like uh uh we just like did like those 21 sets nothing more like after you've done this you just take a break and then you do this again like three times and that's a wrap and that's what i call is a wrap but yeah maybe it's not that uh <laughs> Interesting, maybe. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it it is it was a nice exercise, man. So go go exercise, guys. Go exercise, even if you're lazy. Go exercise. Go outside. Uh, maybe play football or something like this. Move your body, baby. That's that's the that's the thing. On the bicep. No, no, no. We did like the whole body. 
We did our whole body. <laughs> we did like uh, squats, squats, bicep, back, everything. I mean, I mean, stretch. Also, stretching is also very important, guys. Guys, try to stretch too, man. Try to stretch too, guys. Try to stretch too. Try to stretch too. All right, I think that's that's good enough. Let's go for the uh, more like cool, fine detail, like line art. Line art. And I think we can also go and take that. I'll make this a little bit bigger. If I'm honest, there you go. Full range of motion. motion. That counts as a full stretch. Real? What do you mean full range of motion? I mean, you should, you should stretch, right? Because if you don't stretch, I think your muscle kind of becomes shorter and shorter. Like my muscles are very short i think i should honestly i should really re really consider just doing like uh um no. uh, doing some stretches every day in the morning i mean yeah every day in the morning like doing some stretches that would be kind of awesome but am i going to do that that's a different question that's a different question yeah let's do that thank you very much oh no with that, let's do the lines here. Let's go. Uh, and then do a bit more. 18. And this is the biggest problem. Really? Okay, okay, nice. Nice, getting all that, all that gain, baby. All that gain, man. All the gain. Uh, we're sure. <laughs> Bro, I mean, if, for example, I can't touch the. Like, I, if I, if like, if I bend over and try to kind of touch the, the floor with my with my hands, I can do that. <laughs> like, I can literally not do that. <laughs> I, I literally can't do that. That's, that's, that's kind of sad, man. You know? That's the sad thing. That's the first thing. Like, or like, able to kind of hold my hands behind my back. Like, I can't do that. Like, it's impossible for me, man. It's impossible. <laughs> I know how you guys can, can be so flexible, but I, I am not that flexible. I'm not that flexible, guys. I'm sorry. I am not that flexible. Can you guys do that? Like, it's consistent. I mean, yeah, I guess it's honestly everything in life. It's uh, at some point everything in life is kind of it's just like consistency, right? <laughs> at some point, it's like if you do whatever you make. I mean, I guess yeah. That's true, Alison. That's also true. That is also true, but I mean, that's the problem. That's. And that's. Uh, uh, yeah. Oh, and by a roll of us. Okay. <laughs> so. Uh. I mean, yeah, I guess I have to do that for sure. And eventually, if I keep going, if I keep going, then eventually I get there. I get there, man. What is wrong with? Uh, I'm like a stone at this point, you know. Like I'm like a brick by brick, you know. I build this by brick by brick, you know. <laughs> I build this brick by brick <laughs> because my muscle is so stiff that I like kind of bricks at this point. 
can just like build you can't just build like i don't know like a whole a whole uh house with my muscles maybe and they won't fall i swear i swear i swear Okay, and they should be a little bit smaller. They should be a little bit smaller, and they should be like, kind of like there. There. Go back here. Uh, but yeah, I, I guess I should really start doing some stretches, otherwise I, I kind of become like very, 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 very stiff. Stiff without like, you know, stiff, stiffness is not a great man, stiffness is not that, stiffness is not that great guys. I don't want to be like, not able to move at all, you know? <laughs> Please let me move. I mean, what exercise are you guys uh, doing, man? What, what exercise are you kind of using? I guess it's just like, like, like stretching, right? Like basic stretch. It's nothing special, right? It's just like a little bit here, a little bit there, and there you go, man. There you go. Okay, now we here. Okay, let's make a little more bigger. There. There. Oh, well, we're getting there, man. We're getting there. We're getting there. Look at this. Sun salutation, all right. I have no idea what that is, but I will salute the sun for sure, man. Every every day of my life, baby. Every day, like praise the sun, baby. <laughs> praise the sun, baby. That's what I'm talking about, man. I was praise the sun. Every time I wake up, I see the sun. Like, thank you for your existing. Thank you for giving me the life. The energy. Honestly, sometimes, sometimes you guys should be really thankful that that the sun exists, like there, and give us like the giving us like the energy that you need to survive. You know, sometimes I think like I think the sun is, is like is not getting enough appreciation. I would say I think there should be like a day. There should, I think there should be like a day that's like the sun. And, it's Sun Appreciation Day, you know? Maybe there exists something like that. <laughs> uh, wait, uh, I realize <laughs> exactly. It's not, and you know, just like thank you, Sun. You know, even if it's like not really like a human being and understand, like, oh, what? Uh, somebody thank me. I mean, it would be kind of weird if it actually, like, you know, understand this. Like, wow, okay, some people actually thank me. I'm kind of happy. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. But yeah, I think just be like grateful for a couple moments. Maybe like a silent hour if you if even if you want to do that. Like a silent hour for the sun. I think for everything we have done for us. And I hope you kind of will save us till next next season or something like that, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it's a little bit too too I don't know, religious or something like that. I mean I think there's like a maybe somewhere out of like somewhere in this world there's maybe some people that kinda of consider like the sun like a religion. And I'm like I'm not against that, you know. Till next what do you mean next commercial break? Uh, there shouldn't be any commercial breaks at all. There should be like only in the end of the video. But okay, interesting. Uh, 
But yeah, I mean, there's a lot of weird religions out there, so I mean, why not like a sun religion, you know? I mean, for sure, like, you know? I mean... Uh, I mean, what do you mean? Oh, okay. I mean, su summer season, let's go. <laughs> All right. I mean, I guess the summer season is kind of like there will be new animes, man. New original anime. Let's go, baby. And <laughs> never mind. All right. Okay. Uh, sometimes I don't understand your yes, aesthetic, Karami. Sometimes I'm too too deep in the sauce, man. Sometimes. It's really difficult for me to get everything down, like talking. Even if I'm doing this for so many, so many days now, it's still difficult, man. It's still difficult, but with time it gets better, you know. Ah, uh, all right, okay. Yeah, I, I, it's just like I don't understand the, that aesthetic, bro. I didn't understand that aesthetic, that, that, but that's okay, man. I have problem to understand a lot of aesthetic recently. But that's okay, man. I don't know why aesthetic is like, kinda like, equalized with... Uh, joke, but that's what I learned from Bilbo, so that's maybe something, you know, maybe... I learned that from Bilbo. So... We know there's something like that. I mean, you're the cringe lord, as you say yourself, you know. <laughs> I think as a cringe lord, I think you're allowed to do like a lot of cringe yourself. Like, I'm like... I'm just, you know... Giving you, like, I think you yourself can give you like the cringe pass. <laughs> it's the cringe pass that allows you to become cringe, you know. There's like a different path, you know, depending like who you are, where you live, and what you do. Some people you get the path, some people don't get the path. That's how, how life works. Sometimes you don't get the path, and that's really difficult. It's a difficult time. <laughs> Honestly, I don't know what I'm even talking about at this point. <laughs> like, I'm just yapping, you know, I'm, at this point I'm just yapping. Yeah, Peru, that's me, baby. Uh, yeah, Peru, that's me. Well, yeah. Uh, maybe one day, guys, I will go to Japan and maybe do like some vlog, you know. Maybe, I think the day I go to Japan, maybe it's like the day I won't be able to stream anymore. Maybe that's, I think that's maybe a, ca a, a case. That's maybe a case for sure. So like, oh my god, guys, I'm in Japan now. I won't be streaming anymore. Well, maybe I will stream. Who knows? Who knows? Yeah, and there should be like kind of like. Yes, sir. I mean, you can just wake your your friend up, you know. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> hey man, stand up. What, what was going on? Month of stream? Uh, maybe, I don't know, like, uh, but for sure not daily streams anymore. <laughs> I don't know, man, like, at this point, like, doing the streams has just became, like, a, like, a part of my life at this point. And I'm okay with that one, to be honest. So you become, like, a life... Life... thingy, what's it? A life thingy. Alright, then this guy's kind of like there. Man, she kind of looking kind of cute, man. Not gonna lie, man. Holy, holy, holy baby. Who, who is she, man? Who is she? Who is she, baby? Let's pick her mama. Let's go. Wait for this bitch more. <laughs> Honestly, should I make me like a hot move? 
Should I should I do like a, as a YouTube model, it's just like a hard move? Oh yeah, that's really good. Like hello guys, and then I would change my voice, kinda, you know. <laughs> Getting the views, baby. Let's go. And then just destroying everybody, body's world. You know, it's like behind every cute VTuber is just like a fat old man. <laughs> but <laughs> you know. Every behind every cute VTuber is like a fat old man. <laughs> that was kind of funny, man. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. Alright, alright. Looking, looking alright, man. Looking alright. But you, Jim Bro, maybe I will make her. Honestly, maybe I make the VTuber mod like a really like. Like ripped, ripped gym, mo gym model. But then again, it's like it also it will take some time until I'm doing this stuff. I'm always saying stuff, but don't be too excited for those stuff to come. Maybe I will do it. Maybe I won't do it. <laughs> it's really depending like how I feel and if I'm actually following through what I'm saying, which I have problem to do it unless I'm really dedicated to do it then yeah maybe uh, yeah let's see let's see let's see how how things goes I would say let's see how things goes maybe you like it maybe you don't like it that's all right nobody has to like everything right nobody has to like nobody has to like me right <laughs> Right, guys, you guys like me. Oh, <laughs> uh, right. So I think like my goal this time is just like finish that line, line, line art and then I'm good to go, baby. Good to go. Yeah. I just what kind of want to practice. Uh, I mean, yeah. I mean, also, uh, I also also want to do that too. That's, I want to see, like, I just want to see how how difficult it is. Like, everybody tells me that's really difficult, but I think it's not really difficult to rig like a V two models. I think it's it is very tedious. I think it's not difficult. It's very tedious. It's like my my I think my my two cents on on the on this matter. But I, don't, I can't really see that how, how, why this should be difficult. It's just like kind of rigging, right? It's just like, it's a lot of points, right? <laughs> I mean, I have no idea. So <laughs> maybe I'm like, kind of like doing something that is kind of like blasphemy. How dare you say that? That's like, it's like, it's like saying Voldemort, like the name you should not say, man. Like, how dare you say something like that? You don't, you don't know anything, man. So, you're not legit. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah, that. I mean, that's for sure. Like, I mean, that's for sure. But I mean, I guess instead of doing something so detailed, I would say just do something more simple, simplified, and then would say work your way up to something more. More complicated. Well, that's again, like again, me. That's again, me. <laughs> but uh, if I don't like learning how to read video model, it's not like a, a daily art stream, you know. It's like that's why people gonna watch me, right? Or like, <laughs> or is this is this is like kind of like. You guys don't really care what I'm streaming as long as I'm streaming. Kind of thing. Are you like that? Are you like that? It. As long as I'm streaming, you kind of you kind of watch whatever I do. As long as I'm here with you guys, just vibing, everything is alright. Poof. I'm not gonna do like a poop stream. I think this is maybe against it, uh, to, like the. 
Uh, thank you very much. Oh, this, this means a lot to me, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Tomo arigato. Dayo. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I really thank you for this. So. <laughs> but damn it, my 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 throat, my kind of voice is kind of like a little bit tired right now. Because every time I before I go to before I go live, I also kind of practice my singing voice or like get like my and daily voice going. So you know, you have like a good voice to listen to also. And uh, also very understandable. But I'm not sure. Maybe I'm talking so much and it's kind of like very mumbling. Mumbly. Mumbly. Which is honestly kind of. kind of sad, but hey. Let's make it like, kind of like here. It's just like, kind of like, uh, I think I just uh, found on on YouTube. Uh, where it is just like doing like R's and B's and like poop 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 or like me 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 kind of thing and doing that, something like that. Ah, it could be better. The, the problem with my voice right now is just that's like I am I mumble too much. That's that's my problem because every time I'm talking some, to somebody, I have to say it twice because they didn't understand what I. I was saying, which honestly to me, I, I was thinking I was talking normally, but I guess people can understand what I'm saying, which is kind of uh, which kind of sucks. And then honestly, that that means just like I I mumble too much, like I'm just mumbling too much, and I have to change that. I have to change that. It's gonna be not. It's gonna be. It's not gonna be easy, but I think it's the worth the try to kind of you know change it. Okay, should be like more like oh, there here. We should try to change it, even if it takes some times. It's it's more like being trying to articulate a lot, you know, articulate one, two, three, and four. Hello guys, how, how are you doing? Like, your mouth should be moving. And I think that's the most difficult part because we are kind of lazy with moving our, our mouth, mouth, which in the end is um, not good. Yeah, not good. But yeah, I think if people can't understand you, that's most of the time just you be not able to articulate your words better and that's the fact man you have to realize that I hate to break it to you man that's how it is man that's how it is man and the thing about it it's not like end all be all you can always work on your voice every day baby and then one day you wake up and then people can understand you have like a happy life and better life and also having like a more deeper voice is also very very helpful i would say in general like i what's really kind of strange is like uh, like look looking good and like having like a deep voice or like being having like like height also like kind of influence also in the job interview which is kind of crazy because you would normally just try to find out, find somebody that is able to do the job. But sometimes people looking for for people that have like maybe a deeper voice or like more 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 beautiful or handsome, as they say. <laughs> Which is kind of sad, honestly. You should just hire somebody based on the skill level, not based on how look how how a man with deep voice and pretty looking exactly. I mean, if you're able to do that, I mean, I guess you kind of won the lottery. 
that's pretty good, man. I think that's pretty, pretty good if able to kind of pull that off. Yeah, let's go in there. I mean, maybe you do have to do like surgery and stuff like that, but uh, <laughs> for all that, I thought about something. Oh, okay, now maybe I shouldn't have thought say so. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I mean, you can always do like what what's called like beauty beauty uh, no, what's called beauty surgery surgery. I don't know if that's really helpful or not. I'm doing that for the beauty of it. Uh, I think it's kind of unhealthy. At some point, I think, I mean, don't get me wrong, I think at some point, like, beauty surgery itself is, is I think, good, you know? Oh, uh, until you read. <laughs> but what I feel like really ugly, you know? <laughs> what if I feel really ugly? I want that, yeah? Uh, but I think, I would say, uh, having like a beauty uh, surgery, I think in general it's not a bad idea. But I think there's like a limit on how much you should tinker on your face, I would say. <laughs> because some people kind of like go a little bit too far with it and that in the end of the day, like your normal looking face looks much better as like the sur surgery one, which is kind of like ironic if you really think about it. <laughs> like you pay so much money just to look good but at the end of the day like the default looking one looks better than your your currently one you know <laughs> like the basic skin looks better than you know the surgery and all this stuff kind of thing <laughs> uh, i don't know if that's calm or bad or good but yeah mm -hmm. I... okay i mean yeah i guess Like, uh, I think it has his pro and contrast for sure, I would say. But I think, like, like it's just my opinion. I think it's just, like, everybody always can get benefit a little bit of surgery. I'm, a, I'm, also, I'm not saying that everybody should do, like, surgery. But I'm saying, like, in the end of the day, like, a little bit of surgery, I think, benefits everybody. If, uh, if, that, if that makes sense. Like, I think everybody can get benefit of a surgery, but I think not everybody should do it like the surgery. Make that sense? <laughs> it's my measure going, but yeah. You think everybody... No, I'm not thinking everybody is ugly. I'm saying everybody can... <laughs> Don't put my words in you. Don't put words in my mouth, man. <laughs> I'm saying that everybody can look beautiful, you know, can look more better than they actually are right now. <laughs> I'm not saying because uh, everybody's ugly, you know. <laughs> but, because <laughs> you you're not born perfect. That's the thing, guys. <laughs> you're not born perfect. I mean, I, I mean, maybe I guess, I guess everybody is ugly, kind of, like me included, but <laughs> because we are not born perfect, guys. Like just from a, like from a, like a standpoint, like that. I mean, I'm... <laughs> yeah. What's wrong with that one? <laughs> What's wrong with that one, huh? <laughs> Don't tell me that. that that's not the fact, guys. Are you telling me like you kind of... I mean, sure, yeah. Like, you can say, yeah, okay. For yourself, you're kind of beautiful. But I'm, I'm talking objectively. Subjectively, everybody is beautiful, you know? Don't let anybody tell you, you know? <laughs> Don't tell anybody. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I know you're kidding, I'm kidding, but, like, <laughs> objectively speaking, we all are, we all are kind of ugly. <laughs> Subjectively, that doesn't really matter, you're beautiful you're the way you are, you know? 
Maybe there's a little bit too much in the nose, but that's just like me. That's like me. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. It's just like me. <laughs> uh, man, this conversation goes really hard way, but yeah. Uh, but yeah, nothing wrong with a little bit of surgery here and there. But you should not go over the limits and ruin your whole face with it. That's the moral of the story, guys. That's the moral of the story, guys. Uh, and I'm, again, I'm not saying everybody's. Uh, maybe yeah, I'm. I'm but <laughs> that's not the point. That's not the point here. <laughs> that's not the point, man. I mean, I mean, yeah, for sure. But uh, let's say if if you could do it, you know, if you could do it, like so let's say money wouldn't be like an option, would you do it? Like. And it and it won't hurt, you know. It, it won't be like something dramatic, because I think everybody with beauty search, I think every, like you're not doing something crazy on your on your face. Damn, that's some confidence. Honestly, I respect. Honestly, I respect that. 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 Damn it! All right, okay, I guess. I guess it's just me, man, huh? Like if I if I had if if I had the chance, I would probably do it. Uh but but I but I'm not the person that would go out of my way and do it. You know. Yeah, uh, like I mean, I I don't I don't hate my face either, but uh, you know it, it can also be like a for sure couple, yeah, for sure couple. As a, like I I'm not, I'm not talking like really like change world changing surgery guys here. I'm talking about like a little bit here, a little bit there, but not really like like a whole face over. I think. I think we kind of missing the point here, man. Like I'm talking here, like you guys need to chill, man. <laughs> Let me get rid of it. Exactly, you know, exactly. Like something for something like that, man. You know, for something like that. Like not not something something huge. Not very little stuff. This is gonna have Nah, don't say that, man. <laughs> it helps my argument. <laughs> or so, I don't know, man. <laughs> uh, a little more. It helps my argument, man. Or maybe not, I don't know, man. Like, I don't know even what, what I'm even ar arguing with. <laughs> like, I lost the whole point. But I would say if I had a chance, I would do it. But I'm also like, wouldn't go out of my way and do it. That's, that's, that's just me, man. That is just me, man. And I think with that out of the way, I mean, we always have that. Uh, not really. Honestly, I would know. Like, I, I like, I would just let my let the doctor tell me, okay, what, what, what doesn't look that great on my face, and then the doctor would say it's that, that, and I'm alright, okay, then change that a little bit, and boom, there you have it. <laughs> <laughs> because I didn't really know what I would what I would change, you know. <laughs> That's the thing, guys. <laughs> I don't know how to make me prettier. That's the thing. I am already the prettiest girl, prettiest boy right there, you know. <laughs> or the prettiest girl on 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 the 
on the castle or something like that. <laughs> that's how that's how it goes, man. Uh, but yeah, I, I, but I would never get like piercing for sure. I would never get like piercing. <laughs> it's true. I mean, yeah, what's wrong with that one? I don't handle that, but you, you can be better, man. You know, self improvement, baby, self improvement, man. Uh, self improvement. Hey, let's go. That looks kind of cute, right? That looks kind of cute. But yeah, I would never do piercing because honestly, I don't think piercing that that cool. Maybe when I was maybe in school, maybe I had like, maybe I like I had like a like a maybe. Uh, like a time where, where where I thought like getting like those ear piercing or like those maybe mouth piercing would be cool, but uh, but honestly now for the thing looking back, I'm kind of glad I didn't do it. So that's something for sure that I'm kind of happy now that I didn't do that. <laughs> uh, but I'm ah, uh, but. Yeah, that's that's basically it. Because I don't don't get me wrong, but I don't really like uh, I don't find I don't think piercing that that attractive. Well, why am I I'm like the only one? Do you guys like piercing, guys? I like into like hell yeah, man. Getting all the piercing, baby. All right. She kind of looking cute, man. Really piercing on. I mean, I guess. But honestly, eating and stuff wouldn't that be like in in your way, kind of? No, there's too much. <laughs> really. <laughs> too much. Too much. Too, too bad, huh? Made it too cringe or like, I don't know. <laughs> I'm looking at me, I'm like, look at too bad, huh? Uh, I really it because the piercing touch the gums and teeth and, ah, oh, okay, okay. I mean, I don't know how it goes, I just, it was a long, long time ago, so. I have no idea how, what what exactly goes behind everything like that. But yeah, <laughs> I mean, can you send me some pictures, Karami? <laughs> because I don't think that's, that 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 can that can be that bad, right? It can be that bad. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, I would say I I would do that, but. What what I like to do is or I like to wear is like some accessories, but yeah. I'm supposed to do? just just do like a sneaky picture, you know, like be like an undercover picture, <laughs> or maybe not. I think that's illegal. I think. <laughs> uh, but yeah. I mean, I guess they kind of pull it off because they are attractive, but if you don't, if you're not attractive, then like piercing doesn't really do anything, right? <laughs> oh, even worse, it makes you look even deep worse, you know? <laughs> like, oh no, you had something good going on, you kind of throw it away everything. Oh no. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'd say. I think I will just let it be that for that for now. And I guess tomorrow we'll do like a little bit more line weight to that. Because right now it's just like a line. And I want to, put, want to put more line weight into that. Uh, but yeah. 
I would say that's it. A little bit quick, a quick little streamer room. No more lineup, please. <laughs> Why you hate lineups? I mean, maybe I will just paint it. Maybe I just go and get get over my fear of line art and just like paint it. Uh, and yeah, I think that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. I'm yapping every day on streaming too. <laughs> and yeah, see you on the street. Ain't no way. But yeah, they are paying off. I mean, true, true. I mean, I have like a good reference, you know. If you do lime, I don't draw any, everything again. I mean, yeah, I, can, I mean, I can do that, it's true. I can just like make some lines thicker and fi thinner like this. Like, I think a tool for that, but I have to figure that out which tool it is. Uh, but otherwise, yeah, I think that's it, guys. Yeah, see you later, guys. Have a good night, good dreams, or whatever you're doing. Bye. Thanks for watching. Bye.